a little bit uncomfortable, but Tizian, he'll clear the angles. The bomb eventually gets planted on towards the site. And the kill from Fur, the peak comes through, but got B able to stand tall with the SG. And it's back into a 3v3. Molotov goes towards window, and Lucas is just waiting, waiting for a mistake, an overextension from B, but it's not coming through. Lucas gets dropped as Tabson is showing up, and that's a great sign for Big. He was quiet yesterday, but if he's here, then Big have a great chance. And this is more of the rounds we need to see from Big, where they're not just setting up nades until 20 seconds are left, like we saw often yesterday against Astralis. This was much more of a contact play in towards the B site, which allows those individuals a bit more freedom to try to find those headshots. Cold Zero looking for a kill or two at the end hit. Gets one with the MP9, but the money on MIBR is kind of questionable. I think I probably prefer them to take a safe approach here and just go for a low buy into this round, especially with They'll spam on in, but they've got this control of long pretty early already. You know, if you take a look at the clock, they've left this setup. They've, they've went with this quite a few times. They just sent Zenteras on its own towards short. Want to take control of long and Zenteras caught between multiple players. And because of that, he gets overwhelmed and Lucas takes the first kill. That is the worry sometimes when Xantares makes these lone wolf plays for Big. He gets caught out, but Big focusing fully towards A long. MIBR trying to slow this one down. The Molly will do so, and the shot lands from Lucas. This is looking like a problem for Big. Yeah, well, Tapson goes back into the Molotov. It's going to be the boost over the top from Fallins to try and see what he can find in the forward tackle. He'll look over the top with the AWP, looking for the pick, but oh, this is awkward. Flashbang's coming through. Tackle was on the player behind the car, but it's been eliminated. The kills have come in. It's all on Tizian and MIBR. They walk away with a win. So that was absolutely mental. Yeah, again, MIBR not focusing on A long at the start of the round. They focus on the A short control. Quick enough. So the bomb has got towards the ramp, but the kill coming in from Zanteras is making it look pretty good for Big as it's pulled right back. We'll have the sight for the meantime. 30 seconds. Got B with a follow up further. This is where he'd love to be in behind. Zanteras with the nade in his hand. Fallen picks up a kill as well. It's all on Tizian and got B to try and hold on for Big. Flashes go over the top as Tizian looks back over towards short. He'll rattle a couple of shots, but it's got B stepping up. Two kills from the in-game leader, and it's all on Taco. A 1v2, the op is there, but got B, what a play. Four kills for got B, and certainly showing up here at Koo. God B is running through early. Tizian going forwards, but it's God B in with the opening. Cold Zera traded through the smoke. Again, it's God B doing damage with the SG. He's showing he can play with a weapon. And there's no all to really challenge it. There's Furt. Wow. He's going to be finished off. Got B with another great kill. It's all on Taco and Fallen. A 2v4. Oh. As Taco is going to be looking for this pick. Dennis has a nade in his hand. Unfortunately, Taco can't pick it up. Zenteros is going to finish him off, and it's all on Fallen. It's not going to be a round win for them here. Fallen just... The best outcome here is a save. I love how big are still playing this so, so safe. Make sure you've got the smokes for the cross. Don't give Fallen any free frags. Santaris has got the Molotov for short as well. So Fallen has to stand in the flames and he's about to be dead. Got B. Oh no, you've got to get that kill, God B. Fallen nearly <laughs> finds it, but God B eventually closes out the round. That's his second quad kill of yeah. the site. Galil in hand. Molly forces him oh. forwards, but he spots oh. the shadow. Molly is there. He's so low on health. Tabson trying to land the shot. Both so low, but Fallen finds the frag. It's the 1v2 for Fallen as MIBR get the round. 15th round win. Why is it always so hard, though, Dinko? Oh my goodness, the B site play from MIBR was so close to working. Tabson got that scout shot at the start of the round as well. Some really clean kills came in for Tabson in this one. See these headshots at the end, so well done oh. from him. And off the back of such a scary round, it's Big who take the timeout. I'm going to be honest there, it didn't look like there was a single chance for Tabson. When, when there was a crossfire established inside of the control, and when Big changed it up, they lost a whole lot of B control. So, MIBR... They certainly have to feel a bit more comfortable on the T side. They got the good start that they want. They just have to convert the pistol win. If they can't do that, then that's what beat the step right back up. And look at that. Tizian lines up two. Taku and Cold Zero finished off. Oh. Another one for Tizian. Oh. There's the quad kill. This is absolutely insane. Tabson follows it up. And Big just dismantle MIBR. He's just doubled his kills on the B hold. 4K for Tizian.